When you came back from Iraq, what was getting back into civilian life like for you? It was pretty fast-paced. Uh, when I came back, I took less than a month off, got back into my civilian job as a operations manager for a communications company, bought a house, took care of my family, got married, officially got married. Um, I had a whole lot of other goals to do, um, continue college, and work on my degree, finishing up my degree. So you had a wife, you had a son? I had a wife, I had one son at the time, and I had a second son on his way. And you had a job? And I had a job. How did things go wrong? I think I started uh, drinking heavily and uh, certain symptoms of PTSD kicked in. I didn't know what was going wrong with me. I started isolating a lot. What do you mean isolation? I didn't want to be around a lot of people, large crowds. Started sedating myself heavily with alcohol uh, to sleep. What was it about the crowds that bothered you? Just like in Iraq, when the crowded areas, marketplaces, we usually got attacked with our uh, market areas. So large crowd uh, brought up my alertness. It uh, triggered on many panic attacks, and I didn't want to be in large crowds and flip out pretty much and injure or hurt somebody that was innocent. So I avoided those at all due costs.